I've done a bit of work recently using like third-party manufacturers for SLS, selective laser sintering. So it's similar to metal 3D printing, like using powder bed fusion. So you have the bed of powder and uh, essentially a laser sintering the plastic together. And and then as the build platform drops down, it coats the powder on it again and it builds up the next layer. And that's still uh, thermoplastic like with the FDM it just gives better properties really in the print and it allows you to have a little bit more flexibility in the design it's quite affordable like the part ended up being a couple of hundred US dollars for like an intake manifold that in the past would have probably had to be CNC machined out of aluminium or something and been horrendously expensive or you would have fabricated something and maybe it wouldn't have ended up being quite as good looking so a lot of these manufacturing services can print parts for you an sls printer is usually a couple hundred thousand dollars it's not something you're going to have at home 